<coughs> that will take too long to answer. I'll give you a very short answer and I'll refer you to the chapter on this in my book, Pax Indica. I'm afraid six years after I published that book, it's still entirely valid without one comma being changed. The entire chapter in Pax Indica, it's a penguin for your back. Um, India and the world of the 21st century. The short answer is, we cannot get there alone. It would have to be part of a comprehensive reform of the Security Council. That requires a two-thirds majority in the General Assembly and no opposition from any of the existing permanent members. So you need a formula that is simultaneously acceptable to two-thirds of the world and not unacceptable to the five countries whose powers you would be diluting. That is a very, very tall order, not easy to do. So far, in 26, 27 years of negotiation, nothing has moved. There is no formula that all countries are willing to sign up on. I think it's a big danger that the UN will become more and more irrelevant if some reform were not established. But for the moment, the problem India is facing is that uh, even though there's less controversy about us and the Pakistanis are the only real major obstacle, Indonesia to some degree. Every one of the contenders has an, has an opposition. So, with Germany and Japan, the Italians say, but well, we lost the war too. You know, why, why should they only come in? The um, Africans say we should have two because we're 54 countries in the UN. The Latin Americans say, why Brazil? They don't even speak the language of the rest of Latin America, which is Spanish. They're a Portuguese speaking country. Why do you want to create problems between us we don't have currently, etc.? So all of the opposition is often linked to somebody will gain, somebody will lose, why should we lose? That's also part of human relationships. So uh, at this stage, I don't see an easy way out. So it's not going to happen today or tomorrow. But in the long term, for the UN's own viability, some reform has to happen or the organization will lose all credibility. 